The U.S. Office of the Inspector General has asked the Torrance County Correctional Facility to relocate its ICE detainees after a report claiming the facility's conditions are poor. But Action 7 News reporter John Cardinelli is here with an opposing view. Doug, according to the report released on Friday, ICE says it will not relocate its detainees being held at the Torrance County facility. And today, one U.S. Congresswoman showed up unannounced to see the conditions for herself. The U.S. Office of the Inspector General called for ICE to relocate its detainees from the Torrance County Correctional Facility due to deplorable conditions highlighted in a report last Friday. What we saw in the facility did not match the OIG report. I want to be completely clear about that. On Monday, Democratic U.S. Congresswoman Melanie Stansbury visited the facility unannounced and asked for a tour. The sinks were working. We did not see mold. The facilities were clean. Our understanding was this is the normal operations of how the facility is maintained and managed day to day. Contrary to the report, she even said there was hot water. Stansbury only noticed one problem in an area of the facility that was not housing inmates. And there was a smell of sewer coming out of one of the uh, blocks where folks are currently not being housed. And it was explained to us that they're doing plumbing repairs currently. Core Civic, the company who runs the facility, told KOAT on Friday that they felt the inspectors responsible responsible acted in a deeply unethical manner, including misrepresenting evidence to negatively portray the facility. We're asking for an immediate review of the conduct of the inspectors. Stansbury says she isn't sure what the OIG inspected. I don't know why um, why it is incongruent with the current findings, but um, but it may have been that they were creating a full picture of the entire facility. Stansbury says she will follow up with the office to see where reporting may have gone wrong and make sure any further findings are consistent. I'm John Cardinelli reporting KOAT Action 7 News. Now we reached out to the Torrance County Sheriff. He told us in part, I have personally been to Core Civic many times and have not seen any of these issues. It is always clean and they seem to have plenty of staffing for their jail population.